Let's just talk about the uh, contract for a day. Yeah, uh, definitely something that, you know, as my career started to wind down, something that I had in the back of my mind and, and wasn't sure exactly when it would happen or if it would happen. Um, you know, thankfully for, for me, uh, Mickey reached out to me last year during the season asking if, there, if it was something that I would want to do. And I said absolutely. And, and him and Sean were gracious enough to, to bring, you know, bring me in and allow me to spend some time with the guys and to, to get the contract done. So uh, I feel like it's the uh, the proper ending for sure. How much did you not want to go out of house? Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, I, that was an interesting situation. I thought that they would have just released me, um, but, you know, they made me sign the retirement papers. And, um, you know, I, I figured they would be cool enough to, to release me from that so that I could retire here. And, you know, yeah. yeah. You and the wide receiver group helped that. When Drew was throwing the ball, did you just want to run a route just to catch one more time? Uh, well, maybe the first day, like Tuesday. But, but, but by today, I'm like, nah, I'm good. I let, let these young guys do it. Um, but they, yeah. I feel like they've got a, a really good young group, um, a very talented group. And I think that they'll be even better this year than they were last year, especially with the, uh, the addition of Curtis Johnson coming back and coaching those guys. And with the completion of your career, do, do you look back on, on one singular moment that stands out above the rest now? I mean, what's the uh, perspective? One singular moment? Yeah, I mean, there's there's plays here and there. I mean, obviously, two-point conversion in the Super Bowl, but I, I think this – just the, the feeling winning that Super Bowl. I mean, that, that's something that you can't replicate that. You can't duplicate that in your life unless you do it again. And, and um, I'm one of the fortunate guys that was able to, to win one. And, um, you know, that's something that, that I will always remember you know, for the rest of my life. Curtis is an improved face for you and a lot of guys around here, but a lot of these wide receivers out there. What do you think they'll be able to learn from him? They're, they're going to learn a lot. Uh, they're going to learn quick that, that he uh, has no filter. Um, but he's going to coach guy number one just as hard as he coaches guy number 13. Um, and, and, you know, he's going to be a little bit different from what they're used to. But I think that, uh, you know, he's, he's one of the best in the business. Um, definitely the, the best that I've been around. And I think that their level of play will, will be elevated heavily by, by having them coach them. And he'll stay on them. I mean, it won't be a thing where he gets satisfied with how they're playing. He's going to want them to play better and better. And, I think he'll be the one that, to, to be able to get the most out of him. You regret you leaving New Orleans? Do I regret leaving New Orleans? Do you Orleans? ever regret? I, well, I didn't leave New Orleans by choice. So, no, I mean, I don't have any regrets. Uh, I was fortunate enough to play a couple more years after I played here. Huh. But, you know, you know, nine years here, this is, this is you know, home for me. And, you know, like I said, I'm, I'm happy that I was able to come back and retire here. Hey, Lance, do you ever see yourself coaching in this league? Is that something that you would um, I can't. I, I can't say that now. Um, I, I do love the game. I do love the wide receiver position. I do love coming back and helping the guys. Um, as far as putting in the, the hours, um, right now probably not. Um, you know, I just got married. I have a young family, so I want to spend as much time with them as possible. And you know, maybe maybe down the line, something I could do for sure. Lance, you got one more celebration in you. One more celebration. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a lot of them, but uh, not scoring any more touchdowns, so I keep it to myself. How's your reaction to Sean if they finally feeling those back a little bit? Uh, I was excited. Um, you know, I was definitely a little disappointed it didn't happen two years earlier. Um, but I, I think it's, you know, you, know, you talk about uh, the fan experience at the game and, and doing whatever they can to, to boost ratings and things like that. I think it'll be cool to be able to incorporate other people, especially the guys that don't get much recognition. Um, It'd be interesting. You know, I, I think it'll be some some of the celebrations will be great. Some of them won't be so great. But I think it'll be fun all in the same. Thank you. Thank you.